up, folks. Dr. Moreland. We got pre-owned deals that'll knock you off your feet. Tell them about it, Jeff. Over 50 cars for $1.99 a month. That's $1.99 a month. Check us out, folks. 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Over 400 pre-owned cars at MorelandGM.com. That's MorelandGM.com. And if Moreland's done on the back of your car, you pay too much. Good morning. Welcome back once again to the Statesman News Network. My name is Corey Knowles and today is Tuesday, March 15th. A few things in a can today. Uh, when Gene Rom retired from teaching music at Dexter Schools Elementary to Dexter Schools music Elementary students years ago, her work in the classroom might have ended, but her work with children hardly even paused. If the staff at Keller Public Library have it their way, it never will. Each year at Keller Public Library's Friends of the Library annual dinner and fashion show, the evening begins with the naming of the Friend of the Year, a person designated for the honor by virtue of his or her efforts toward improving literacy through working among the Friends of the Library organization. The presentation of the annual award to Gene Rom Monday night was met with a standing ovation from the crowd of well over 200 attending the, the event at the Dexter Elks Lodge. Uh, most often heard among the guests was well-deserved, so... Uh, congratulations to Miss Rom. Um, there's more on this story, big picture, and some things like that you'll want to read. In other news, Stoddard County Commission voted to sign an engineering contract to replace a bridge on County Road 420 in the western part of the county and to begin the process of having the stretch of Highway 25 north of Bloomfield designated as Veterans Memorial Highway at their meeting on Monday. Dennis Cox, an engineer and owner of Smith & Company in Poplar Bluff, told the commission that the Missouri Department of Transportation has given approval to the preliminary project and have reached the point where we can sign an engineering contract now. He gave the commissioners cost estimates of replacing the County Road 420 bridge and another bridge in the Lavelle Special Road District as well. Both of those have been targeted by the commission as needing to be replaced. Cox also said there would be some money available as a soft match, so I have to see about that. Uh, there's a full story on here. It gets more in-depth with the deal about the road to the Veterans Memorial Highway thing. That's, that's pretty neat. Uh, Mike talks a lot about that. Do you want to read it? Uh, also, weather. Today, you can have an eye around 47. The low, I think, it's supposed to be about 35 degrees. Should be clearing off as the day goes on and uh, looking warm as far as the eye can see on the forecast. So, that's good. So, basically, if you like the cold, get your fill today because it's going out. Uh, I'd like to thank everyone for tuning in to watch the Statesman Newscast. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to send me an email at cnolds at dailystatesman.com or give me a call at 624-4545. Don't forget to pick up a copy of our print edition for the stories we've talked about and a whole lot more. And on that note, we'll see you back here on Wednesday. Thanks for watching.